bouncing puck will go to Nick Johnson for the shot, a save by Doming, rebound, score! Craig Cunningham with the excellent play there to stuff it around Doming on the rebound, and just 53 seconds in, Providence takes the 1-0 lead. 17-11 to go in the first period, a Craig Cunningham goal just 53 seconds into the game gives Providence the lead, and there's a good save by Doming with the blocker. He's run into by Flick. Shinneman takes it back, gives to Fairchild, left point, slap shot on the way, tipped. It was wide of the goal. We've got a penalty coming, and it's going to go against Providence here as Mike Moore touches it up. It'll be a holding the stick call against the Bruins. Now back in front, slammed away though by Robbins, played right back through the slot. Now Brodor tries and scores! Matthew Brodor from the top of the left circle with 12.02 to go in the first period. Portland has tied the score at a goal apiece. Hoping we can get lots of money and maybe a few businesses to, uh, to step forward and, and match that as well. Here's so. a save by Doming, but we're going to get a penalty called here against Portland as going after the rebound was Tyler Randall and he got pulled down, so Portland is going to go shorthanded here. The last second, Koklachev, though, the other way. Good pass to Griffith. Seth Griffith, a shot, and a good save by Doming. Rebound, score! Trailing the play to pick up the goal is Ryan Spooner from the bottom of the left circle, and he'll slam home the power play goal with 11 minutes to go in the first period. Down the right side, playing on the right instead of his normal left wing here tonight. Good hit in front, Mealy shot, and it just went too high as he had Subban dead to rights off the turnover side. Here comes Koklachev, maybe two on one with Florek. Koklachev right side, in front to Florek, and he scores. Justin Florek with the one-timer on the two-on-one as Alexander Koklachev sets him up, but he couldn't do so as Trotman was able to knock the puck away. There's a hit by Yip on Cunningham. That plays behind the net to Spooner. Here's Nick Johnson, side of the left circle. Good pass there in front, and Cunningham scores. Spooner, what a play to Cunningham as the Providence Bruins have had some Harlem Globetrotter-esque plays here. Looks like we are going to get another goaltending switch for the second game in a row here. This goal by Cunningham is second of the night and 24th of the season. Comes at 13.53. Here with 5.23 remaining in the first period. Face-off one by Portland. It was Shinneman now turning it over. Loose puck in front, and they score! It's Rob Flick with the goal off the turnover there. The centering feed by Randall. Jones again at the right point to Mealy. Side of the right circle. Mealy looking in front to Stahlberg. Warwick from behind the net tried to jam it in. But a save again by Malcolm Subban. Front, Warwick can't settle it for a shot. And there's a big collision between Stahlberg and Eudes. They're both up, and there's a quick turnover and a score! Brendan Shinneman will get $25 to the Central Maine Comprehensive Cancer Center for a goal he scores! It up ahead to Mealy now. Mealy down the right wing into the zone. He'll get it in front to Reader. Score! What a play by Andy Mealy to set up Tobias Reader. A minute 17 into the second period, and the Pirates have cut the lead back to two. Here comes Kennedy back up ice. Chance for a three on two for Portland. Kennedy down the right side in front to Fairchild. Great play, and they score! Wonderful one touch feed by Fairchild to Yip. At the side of the right circle now. Out to Malindi, one timer gloved by Svedberg. That was a good save there for his first of the night. As he'll hang on to that one, is a little pushing and shoving. Back to Reader, top of the right circle, slap shot, save Svedberg, and he clears the rebound to the right corner. Mealy, torqued down, penalty coming to Providence. There's the touch up. So Portland will be on the power play when we come back in 30 seconds in the first period. But now here's going to be a shorthanded chance for Spooner, but he's going to be hooked in a penalty coming to Portland. So that'll do it for the power play here as Jones touches it up. He's still battling for it, uses the big reach, gets in front of Martinook. Now Fairchild, left point, right point, Malindi, slap shot. That one stopped by Svedberg, and there's no rebound. He'll hold on, and we'll get a whistle again. 
Griffin takes back over, and here's Spooner with a lot of speed through the middle. Spooner into the zone. Good pass there to Cunningham. Cunningham the goal. A save made by Rawlings as Cunningham was going for the hat trick. Just scoot into the Portland zone, but it's lifted down the ice on the backhand by Brodor. The puck loose. Svedberg had to glove it out of the air there. As Providence attempted to clear it, it was fanned on in front of Svedberg. But it goes to Fairchild, left point through traffic. What a save by Svedberg with the glove there as it was low, only about six inches off the ice. Greg Carey to Lewis, knocked away from him, and Warwick won't get it. In comes Lindblad, leaving for Sexton for the shot, and they score. Ben Sexton with his first professional goal through traffic, might have redirected on the way in there, but it beats Chris Rawlings to the stick side. Reeder sends deep here, he's knocked down, penalty coming to the Bruins. Cunningham touches it up and Portland will be on the power play when we come back. Incidental contact though, but now a two on one the other way, it's Spooner down the left side, jams on the brakes, he'll shoot, saved by Rawlings, no rebound, as he's able to stop it with the glove and hang on here. He'll lose it, get it back. Now Lessio to the front, grabbed by Mealy, and he scores! Andy Mealy puts it in with three seconds to go. Might be a too little too late here, but the Pirates down by just one. It's six to five. 